Hello YouTube and welcome to another general vlog video. Today we're doing a job that we don't want to do. Well tonight. It is about 9, 9.30 at night and I have my stepmother's dog in here. Uh, if any of you guys have been following my channel, <clears throat> you may have heard me mention that she had I don't know all the procedure names. They went in and took, I, I don't know what they did. Somehow they went in to clean her heart out, their valves, and they knocked plaque loose. And some of the plaque went to her feet and looked, yeah. anyways, she got um, her left foot amputated, left leg, I guess I should say, and then partial her right toes were amputated. And she's been on dialysis for about three to four years now. Uh, she goes three, three days a week, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. They put her in a nursing home. She was home. Then she had to go to the hospital with complications. And then they put her in a nursing home. Candy, no baby. And then they had to rush her to the hospital the other night. And basically, she's bleed candy, no babe. She's bleeding inter internally through her stomach wall. Uh, basically, long story short, there's nothing they can do for her. So they are sending her back home to peacefully pass away. No candy. With hospice is going to be there. Uh, hospice just called and said that they're going to bring, I guess they want to bring their own bed, a hospital bed, and her air makeup unit, uh, even though we've got all that, they want to bring their own, so they're bringing it at 9 o'clock in the morning, and then they will transport my stepmom from, and by the way, this is my stepmom of over 40 years. Um, they are bringing her from where she's at to here, which is about 30 miles. And with hospice there and all the family there, they're just going to peacefully let her go. Well, her pride and joy is her two dogs. She has a Chihuahua, which is named Pepper, and Candy is some kind of a Lopso Opso or something. I'm not really sure what she is. I don't pretend that I know. And the Pepper is okay. Pepper's a short-haired Chihuahua, and she stays clean. She looks clean. She smells clean. Candy is a longer-haired dog, and... I don't want to trim her or anything, I just want to get her all fluffy and everything. Um, and it's the first time she's ever been at my house. So I'm going to bring her here in, in here in the tub. Let me turn this water off. And I want my stepmom, no baby, just a second. I want my stepmom to see a clean fluffy candy when she gets home. So candy is the dog of course. So that's my job tonight is to make her look as presentable and beautiful as possible. So let's get you down here on the action. I've already got some shampoo and yes, I know I'm using human shampoo and it's not going to hurt her. I don't believe. And this is how my stepmom always got her to be nice and fluffy and white. So this is what we're going to do. So, let me get Candy here. Let me get her collar off. There we go, baby. And let me fill the water. Make sure that it's okay. Um, that may be a little too warm. So, I'm going to put her back down. Here she is. Say hi, Candy. <laughs> let me not hold her where her legs are up there like that. Say hi, Candy. Say hi. Candy is deaf. Uh, if she has any hearing left, it's probably only about maybe 5%. So she's mostly deaf. Um, I know you guys heard me telling her no candy, hold on, hold on, and all that stuff. She can't hear me. But she looks up at you and kind of knows. Pepper, I hope that light ain't blinding you guys. Let me shut this for a second. Uh, Pepper, who is the Chihuahua. Uh, once again, I'm not going to pretend I know what's wrong with her, but she has to have two shots every day. She's like a diabetic or something. And, uh, anyways, that's, yeah. 
dogs have had a hard life and their mom's had a hard life. So, anyways, we're going to get her all nice and presentable. So, let me get her down here. It should be cooled off by now. Please excuse the light. I have nothing else I can do. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Good girl. Um, oops. Stay. Stay. Um, yeah, I know. You kind of do sign language with a dog. Um, I've never given a dog a bath. Or at least never given this dog a bath. And it's been years if I ever have given a dog a bath. But she's used to getting a bath. She used to get a bath once a week. It's okay, honey. I'm talking to her, knowing good and well she can't hear me, but, all right, so what we're going to use is, that's conditioner, let's get you all cleaned up, excuse you, uh, nope, don't, don't, don't shake yet, don't shake yet, let's get her, oh, I, I'm looking, trying to, yeah, it says shampoo, but it doesn't seem to be really shampooing up much. Oh, it does smell good. That, that's what candy's supposed to smell like. And we're almost out. Just in enough time to make Mama all proud of her baby, huh? Yeah. Let's get that white all nice and white. Yes, let's get that... White, all oh, nice and white. Let's scratch her all down and make her feel all good. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. All right, so we're out of shampoo, and I still need some for her belly. So I'm going to use this up here. smell is good but the majority of it's on there get your old feet and everything and like I said I, I know you guys probably don't want to see the back side of me doing this and wash the top of your head and wash them old ears yes and wash that old nasty face and keep it out of her eyes there we go. Good girl. Yeah, I got it all out of your eyes. Get your belly all cleaned. She don't have fleas or anything of that nature. So, she's doing really well. She's an inside dog. Ah, big. She's an inside dog. So, let's get this at a decent temperature for her. Hold on, baby. Now, that's too cold. That's too cold. Yeah, here, hold on. Ah, there we go. Perfect temperature for the baby. Yes, look at that. Don't that feel good? Don't that feel good? Yes, it does. She's doing really, really, really well. She's really helping me out a lot. Because, like I said, I don't know how to do this. But I'm the only one that's available right now to do it. All right, let's see if we can't find a different thing. There we go. Now, look at that. Now, hold on, don't, don't shake yet. Don't shake yet. Let me get the rest of your face all clean. Let me get the rest of your face all clean. Yes. Good girl. Well, what's the secret to getting all the shampoo off of her, uh, off her belly? It's kind of hard to do. It's not like I can lay her upside down. Okay, can you turn around for me? Turn around. Good 
girl. Well, you gotta stay turned around, babe. You got hair in your eye, babe. You got hair in your eye. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Let's get them old eye boogers out of there. Let's get them old eye boogers out of there. Good job, girl. You a good candy. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. You a good girl. Go ahead and shake. Go ahead. You're going to. Oh, my goodness. So we gotta let this, <laughs> baby. Yeah, get all the hair out of your eyes. I should trim some of that, shouldn't I? Let's get the rest of this stuff up. Come here. Let's get the now. You are just a, like a drowning little rat. Yes, you are. You a drowning little rat. You ready for some? Uh, ready for some cream rinse? throw it at you there. There's not much of that left either. Uh, my stepmom has been in and out of the hospital quite a bit for the past, oh goodness, I don't know, uh, almost a year. Probably, excuse me, I gotta get up here and get this. Stay. Candy. Candy. Look at me. Stay. 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 She knows what that means. I'm trying to get you guys a little different ca camera angle where maybe you don't have to look at my backside the whole time. Good girl. Yes, you are. Ah. Wait a minute. Come here. Let's get a bunch of this on. This is what makes you fluffy. This is what makes her fluffy. Yes, it is. Get that old face all fluffy. I know, I'm not getting it in your eye. Don't worry. I'm not getting it in your eye. No. We're trying very hard to do this good. And hear that squeaking. It almost sounds like she's yelping. That's actually my hand on the bottom of the tub. I know. I turned the heat up so you wouldn't be cold. Yes. All right, so now she's going to shake again, and we're going to get this temperature just about perfect for her, maybe warm her up just a little bit. Yeah, she's doing really good. Get the inside of them old ears. That feel good, huh? That feel good. Oh, I bet it does. Let's finish your body. Let's finish your body. 
you got to like that. Boy, you're getting all kinds of pettings and rubbings and yes, you just a good girl. So I'll tell you guys a little story about when I was a kid, more of a teenager, but preteen teenager, my stepmom had a cat. And I think his name was Haji, if I'm not mistaken. You like that baby, huh? You like that? Anyways, the cat. Okay, I'm going to shut you in for just a second and let you shake as much as you want. Go ahead and shake, babe. I don't know if you can hear that. She just did it. Is that all you're going to do? Just one? Anyways. Oh, there she tried. She's doing it again. All right, okay. Here. Let, let's get you all dried off. Nope, not out yet. Anyways, th this cat that my stepmom had would not drink out of a bowl. It only drank out of the faucet. You had to turn the faucet on. Let me uncover your head there, baby. Um, you had to uncover the, or turn on the faucet on low, barely a trickle, about the size of a pencil lead. And that's how the cat drank. So always growing up, we always had our water trickling. And it was because of the cat. That's how the cat, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, Let, let's get your face. Let's get your face. Oh, you so pretty. Yeah, you such a pretty girl. Anyways, and friends of mine would come over, and they're like, oh, you guys trying to make it where you don't have frozen water lines? I'm like, well, dude, it, it's July. So, no. Well, why do you leave your water dripping all the time? Uh, so the cat can drink. And everybody, all my friends just thought that was the biggest thing. Just... <laughs> They thought it was the coolest thing. To me, I grew up that way, you know, so, you know, I've been around it. Let me see. Got any eye boogers? Did I get them all? Oh, I sure did. I got them all, didn't I? Yes. You want to shake again? There you go. I think I got you about as dry as I can for right now. So, oh. You want out? You want out, out, okay. And if you noticed, she, uh, when I asked her if she wanted out, <laughs> she's really going rambunctious over here. When I asked her if she wanted out, of course, you know, she's deaf. And by her being deaf, she don't answer. Ha, huh? yeah, she can't talk. Um, I know, she's a rare breed, she doesn't talk. Uh, although she does bark. <laughs> but anyways, hold on, I'll let you out here in just a second. But anyways, if you'll notice, she come up and hit, hit my hand like that. that. Oh, there, she's talking to me. That was her way of saying, yes, I want out. And fortunately, I think she's very clean. I have brand new carpet. And we know what dogs do on carpet. They like to rub and, and maybe that'll help her a little bit. She, she just bumped into you guys. You guys might have to stand back just a little bit. So I know this video is getting a little longer than what I want, but I'm going to try to let her dry off for about five, 10 minutes. So I'm gonna pause this and then we'll come back as I'm drying her with a hair dryer. Wow, that's a sharp, sharp bark in this little room. Uh, I know you guys are gonna tell me I'm doing this all wrong. I don't know what to do. There's not a veterinarian or a pet grooming place open tonight. Um, we did call one or two that were local and they can't get us in, even though we explained kind of the emergency. Uh, they don't expect her to make it through the weekend and I want to get this done. So I had to do the best that I could. So please remember that before you comment and say, oh, you shouldn't use human shampoo and oh, you shouldn't use human cream rinse and you should have done this better. Please remember I'm doing this 
Yeah. Anyways, yeah, uh, we know why I'm doing this. And please take that in, in consideration before you make crude comments. Oh, she's rubbing all over me. Okay, I'm gonna let her out, let her dry for just a little bit, and then I'll bring you guys right back. Okay, and we're back. I've got her mostly dry, and she does really good with the hair dryer, um, either on low or high. I just put it on high and just keep fluffing her hair. I know, no noise alert, right? Um, She's kind of hanging out with me on the bed here, getting her all dry and all fluffed up. She doesn't even mind it on her head, as you can see. Uh, I mostly towel dried her. It, it's a little harder than what I thought, but as you can see, she's all nice and fluffy again. And she loves her ears rubbed. Look at that, she'll sit there and go to sleep with me doing that. Won't you, huh? Your little paws all dry. Oh, where are you going? You're going over that way? Okay, here, I'll do the back one. No? Can we do the front one? And I just keep, you know, rubbing her paw and, and just basically kind of rub her with my hand dry. Her face is beautiful. She's nice and white and brown again. She is all ready for a debut tomorrow. Turn around, show the camera. Hey, look at the camera. Yes, I love you too. I love you too. Yeah, keep doing that so I can dry that neck a little bit more. I know, she, she can't hear it all. But see how nice and white everything turned out around her mouth and on her head, her little skunk stripe, ends of her toe. Now these are still a little bit wet, so they're not going to look as white and fluffy. And I just keep fluffing her up and, and just... Making sure that she's complete. I would say she's probably, even her little tail's dry. Oh, you don't like me touching your tail? Huh? You don't, see, now you don't mind. Oh, you didn't like that, did you? What? You want to play? Candy. You want to play? Ah! You, would you like to play? Huh? You want to play? You want to play? Huh? You want to play? I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you. Oh, you just want to go outside. I think that's what it is. She does, she's not used to here. So, let me get the camera up here. Like I said, please forgive me if this is not the way that you would have washed this dog. I've never done it before. Or if I have, maybe I've helped somebody. I don't remember. But, yes, Candy, you can say goodbye. Tell her bye-bye. But anyways... Just remember, she's coming home tomorrow to pass away peacefully in her sleep, or peacefully, I don't know. But she loved this dog to keep clean. Between her planting flowers, she had more flower gardens than, than you could possibly imagine. And so tomorrow we want, you know, the whole place filled with flowers, which we have worked on that. I tried to call a couple groomers. It was a last second thought. Everybody's like, oh, wait a minute, you know, Candy, you know, with hospice going to be there and everything, we want her to smell and look the best. So they'll let her up in bed with her, uh, which they already said that they would. And I tried to call a couple places to get her in under an emergency, even told them what the emergency was. And they just said, we're sorry, we can't do it. Uh, one person thought that they might be able to do it tomorrow, like at three. But she's going to be home tomorrow morning about 9 or 10. And I just, I had no choice. I had to do it. So, and I just noticed candy really matches my carpet very well. So anyways, I'm going to get off of here once again. This is a general vlog video. Please give us a thumbs up, like, and please, please, please subscribe. It really helps us out. Will you try to get back in the bathtub now, girl? And once again... 
be easy on the comments down below. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm doing the best that I can for a woman who is passing away. And that's the best that I can do. And I don't feel, I, she, she's perfectly happy. Come here, Candy. Come here. Over here. Hey. Uh, she can't, she's not paying attention to me. Come here, baby. Come here. Yeah, I'm hollering for you. I'm still rubbing her paws, trying to get them completely dry. Say, hey, look, say goodbye to everybody. See, look how nice and white I am now. Oh, I'm so fluffy and clean and pretty. And, oh, it smells so good. Um, oh yeah, her backside's a little wet right here. But if I just keep doing that and fluffing it out, she'll dry pretty quick. Anyways, I hope you guys have a great day and even better tomorrow and an awesome night and we will see you on the next video and maybe again someday since it'll be just my dad and he doesn't know how to, well actually my stepmom always did it in the kitchen sink because they only have a, a stand-up shower so I found it relatively easy in the tub so I'm sure this won't be the last time that we do this so maybe this is just your first TV debut and we'll see you guys on the next video